Hi, I'm Tammy, and I am the Keto Hello, I am back. So graduation went fantastic. For those of you that have been following my journey and my channel for a little while, you know I took about a three month hiatus, even though if I have a really new channel and I felt so bad, um, kind of like I was letting you guys down, because I started this for my friends and family that have so many great questions. And I just thought this would be a good way to answer those questions and like demonstrate the recipes and, and really sit down and have some time in my crazy hectic life to actually explain how I have lost so much weight. Um, and for those of you that may not know, um, my name is Tammy and I'm Keto Cricket. I have lost as of today um, 80 pounds following the ketogenic lifestyle. Um, and I started July 1st of 2017, and today is June something, I don't know what day it is. <laughs> but, um, so July 1st of 2018 will be my ketoversary. So I'm super excited, I never imagined, and I'll, maybe I'll talk about that in another video, I don't know. If you guys are interested in that or not, on kind of why I started keto, um, and kind of where I'm at with it because I, I think that keto is definitely something you progress with um, because you really get a chance to learn and feel really what feels right with with what you eat you know what what happens when I eat this to my body and my mind even like my mental state not just brain clarity but just emotionally um, you know, what are your triggers, that sort of thing. And and I'm not there. I mean, I'm still looking for things. Currently, I'm a part of the Challenge for Keto Meets Menopause. So if you don't know who that is, go check her channel out. She's fantastic. Um, but we are doing a 30-day no artificial sweetener challenge, which I have decided to do um, with them. And for that no artificial sweetener, I'm basically excluding everything except for monk fruit. Uh, and for me, the reason I do uh, monk fruit, if you've, again, watched my channel before, you know that I am allergic to stevia. So I can't have anything with stevia. The downside of that is that all of the cool things that all of these companies are making, they're making with stevia. So um, I make a lot of my own things <laughs> because can't have stevia. So anyway, um, so that's kind of what's going on with me or who I am. Uh, today I want to talk about really quickly, and I know I've already been talking for a little while, so I apologize. And guys, let me know, do you like the shorter, compact videos that are three to five minutes, or do you like a longer video? For me, it kind of depends on my mood. So I kind of have a variety in my YouTube watch list. I like some that um, like highfalutin low carb, I always anticipate his videos, and they're about 25 minutes. They're like a whole cooking show, um, but he also edits phenomenally. He's absolutely amazing. Um, and there's some other folks out there that I like to watch, and I could just probably sit and watch them like a TV show. Um, and then others, if they don't have a lot to say, then I'm kind of like, move on. But anyway, today, what I want to talk about is a little bit of body dysmorphia kind of, sort of, and also just kind of getting into a realization of being content where you're at if that's where you need to be. So we need to all have goals, and I have a goal as well of kind of this is where I want to be or this is the size I want to be. Um, but we need to make sure that that goal is not only realistic and and meet SMART, you know, specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, and time frame. Um, but that it's also, you know, that, that it's achievable in a way that makes sense for who you are. So I'm going to use an example of a dog, okay? So I'm not trying to compare you all to dogs. Don't get mad at me. Do not send me nasty comments. Uh, but if you saw this beautiful St. Bernard, um, you would look at that St. Bernard if you like dogs like I do, and you'd be like, oh my gosh, it's a St. Bernard, and it's so beautiful and fluffy, and you just want to bury your head in its giant mass, right? You would not go to that St. Bernard and be like, hey, St. Bernard, how come you don't look like this poodle over here? 
What's wrong with you? You're chunky. You need to lose weight. No, you would not do that. No, no, no. You'd be like, no, you're you're a Saint Bernard. You have the shape of a Saint Bernard. Um, so, what kind of shape do you have? Don't focus on looking like somebody else. God made you a certain shape and a certain way, and yes, we need to be our healthiest selves, and I'm all for that, as you know. I'm like trying to lose weight myself. But I also don't want to look like um, somebody else because my body is unique to me. So that's a big thing that I wanted to talk about today. It's just really to encourage you to be realistic with your goals and understand that you may need to revise those. Um, I had a number in mind for my goal and now I'm kind of looking at that going, you know what, I may not reach that number. Um, you know, I, I have some areas that I'm working on and, and again I might talk about that in another video, but um, you know, I'm, I'm kind of revisiting that going, you know what, I'm, I may not need to hit that. So I, I do still have some work to do, um, not that it matters because I'm, you know, I'm keto for life, but, you know, we have to take a look at, at how that revision goes and how do we do that. And, and I'm kind of working on that, so maybe we'll talk about that in another video. I have so many video ideas, though, so many things I want to talk about. Um, but you guys let me know, too. Like, what are your questions? And I've gotten quite a few of you guys that have either messaged me or emailed me. You can email me at ketocricket at gmail.com. Um, you could message me if you are in one of my Facebook groups. I don't really accept messages from random strangers. Um, because, you know, that's kind of weird. But if you happen to be in one of the six or seven keto or low carb groups that I'm in, and you've seen me, then you can definitely reach out and I will help you answer any questions you have, um, whether it's macros or, you know, you just want to shoot something off of me and need some help. All right, guys, that's all for today. And I am super excited to get back into some consistency once again. Have a great day.